Okay, so today on Wing Chun Blog Live Theory, uh, for this month we're going to work on takedowns. We're going to talk about takedown defense. And uh, the takedowns that I'm most familiar with are the wrestling variety. So um, this video this series is mainly going to show the basics of how to actually do a proper wrestling takedown because a lot of the ways that Wing Chun guys do takedowns, it's not realistic. You're not going to encounter that. Um, here's a disclaimer real quick. Uh, if you are any type of a traditional martial artist, Bunjinkan, Karate, Taekwondo, Aikido, Wing Chun, anything, okay, and you are between the ages of 13 and 19, middle school and high school wrestling, join it. If there is a team, do your best to join it because it's free martial arts training and a coach and all the wrestlers are going to be much, much better than I am at this. And they're going to handle all of the what ifs and maybe this and maybe that and what if the guy does this. All that will be handled scenario based. You'll get competition. You'll get plenty of experience. That's the best way to stop takedowns, okay? To take wrestling. What this is basically going to do is it's just going to show you the proper way to set up an actual shot, the way they're going to come at you, and the way you need to train. And I want you to pay attention on how to the um, specific mechanics of what makes the shot work because that's how you're going to stop it. You're going to prevent something that makes the shot work and there's four or five things that need to be in place for it to be effective and that's what we're going to attack. Okay, so that's what we're going to do today. Beginning. Alright, so to start with, what we're going to do is we're going to start with Yichi Kimima, just like we're used to in Lin Chun. So feet together, hands in, okay. Now we're going to go toes out, heels out, toes out, heels out. Okay? Now we're in what's called chum cue. You know, we would go here and here and here and do thing. Anyway, so instead of doing the uh, you know, chest up, butt tuck thing for Wing Chun, what we're going to do is we're going to stick our butt out and we're going to bend down just a little bit. We're not going to bend over like this, we're just going to bend slightly bent. Good athletic stance, is what they call it. Knees are bent, weight is distributed not too far on the heels, not too far on the um, toes, basically just right here, centered. Okay? We want to basically have uh, our elbows in. They're not out like this, just like you're doing a jumps out, jumps out, two elbows here. Now, a lot of times when people take shots, they bend over like this and try to reach. You don't want to do that. What you actually want to do when you're ready to attack, this is defensive position. When you're ready to attack now, I take a small step, not a huge step, not this way, not that way, okay? I take a small step and I push off with this foot, it's a spring-loaded position. So from my drop step here, I'm gonna lower my level. I'm not gonna bend over. Again, I'm bending at the knees. So I bend down and I take a step. This is called my penetration step, okay? So you're gonna go heel to the ball of the toe, okay? So again, drop step, lower my level, step, and now you see I'm falling to this knee. A common mistake a lot of people do when they take shots is they wanna do this and it screws them up, you don't want to do that. If this is your lead leg forward, this is the knee that's going to go. It's very awkward to begin with, but you want to practice it. So step, and the knee comes. So we'll try that from this angle, okay? I want to basically come here, good position stance, drop step, lower level, step, this knee hits, all right? You do it on this side, okay? Good stance, drop step, lower level, step, this knee hits. Now, to finish the shot, what you want to do is you're going to drop step, lower level step, this knee hits, lock, you're actually going to grab the opponent's legs, this foot is called the trail foot, it's going to come up and it's going to come right here deep, and I'm going to turn my hips, okay, this is called turning the corner. Now I'm about to finish the shot, what I do here is drop step, lower level step, Drop to my knee, front knee, trail leg comes, get the legs, I'm going to use my head and I'm going to drive it against his ribs. I'm not too far out extending because I'll get guillotine. I'm also not over here. I'm just right up against his ribs and then I'm going to push off with this leg and I'm going to drive, okay? So I go here, rip his legs out from under him as I stand up and I drive. So when it all gets put together, it looks like this, decent speed. Okay, full speed, okay, and that is going to be how, to be how you do a basic shot, okay. Next up, we're going to show how to do it with a partner. We'll go through the mechanics again so you can see, all right. 